I am in my element because, as you know, I am passionate to cook. I love to cook and I cook for about 50 years now. This is a lovely plate of pasta that I'm going to prepare for myself. Because it's possible to cook just for yourself. I prepare to share it with some lovely people, with a woman, or <laughs> possibly with some friends. And here we have the implants that now Carluccio uh, will sell. Look at this wonderful bollitore, it's called, sort of pasta cooker. It has an incorporated uh, sort of um, colander that when you just need to lift it, it's right there. Now, in the bollitore, you put just enough water to cook the quantity of pasta you want to cook. In the ratio that you should have one liter water per 100 grams of pasta. The pasta has to swim freely, able to exude the starch if you don't want it to reincorporate and absolutely no oil, please no oil. You put oil only when you have sheets of pasta, like lasagna, to avoid sticking together. The oil swim on the surface while you put the pasta in, doesn't stay. So we have this. The other very important thing is to add about 10 grams of salt per liter of water. And I have my measure here, sort of this one. And this to enable to put already some flavor in the pasta itself. And I will show you that while the pasta is cooking, a bit more fire, I will do the sauce, so simple. So this is a, a new pasta, wonderful spaghetti al nero di sepia. This pasta is already incorporated black ink of the cuttlefish. And we take a portion which would be like this, put it in the boiling water with the salt, and now I do the sauce. Then we cook in about five, six minutes. Enough time to put some olive oil in a pan, abundant olive oil. And uh, we light the fire. At home it's uh, much easier. You have everything there. No disturbance from any kind and you can cook freely. Now we have here the garlic. Any sauces that you um, buy already made. Take care to have a little bit of arrangement. In this case we need a fresh so the approach with the parsley, garlic, wonderful to have it fresh as well, because I do a pasta with bongole. <coughs> and um, you cut it coarsely, like it's not, uh, and you put it in the oil, frying. Then we have, look here what Carluccio also have now chili. Wonderful chili. Be careful that it's a bit hot. And according to your desire, this is a dry chili. I like to use the seeds because it's a lovely thing. In the seeds is the oops. And now immediately, oh I don't want the garlic to burn. So, and then we have bongo, look at this, with a shell. Just like freshly fish. And you put the lid of the water. Just a little bit. And a lot of bongole. They are delicious. They are the bongole of the uh, Adriatic Sea and they are very tasty and nice. Then we have two wonderful little things. In case the, uh, you don't have the chili, Carluccio, what else? That's also the chili. And you put just a little bit of this. Let's see what the pasta does. We get a little shake. Oops. Yeah, it's good. And then uh, this is the newest thing. It's just water. The old Roman used to use it, the colatura. They were calling it um, liquana. 
and it was fermented entrail of fish put in the sun with salt and then juice, fermented juice, so savory. It was then collected and it is a perfume that is wine. A perfume of fish. And you just need a little bit. Yes, this to accentuate the flavor of the entire dish because the Italian what they like is the flavor. <clears throat> the look is a different thing. Now let's see the pasta. Where's my famous fork? Also you buy a luce, buy that as well. You feel like uh, so the surgeon. <laughs> yes. And you feel when uh, you want the pasta cooked al dente, if you like it. After a few minutes, you take a uh, sort of string and you eat it. And uh, to cook another, another little bit. This, this is my, my dog called Truffle. That is, uh, what happened to you? In the, in the home, is the dog as well. Another minute and then it's ready. Here, the vongole, they're ready as well. I chop a little bit of parsley from my garden. <laughs> Coarsely chopped. And we add it to the vongole. This is a lovely, lovely, mmm, the smell. Let's see what the pasta does. Yes, yes, let's go now. So now what you need to do, just lift this. More practical could be a... Uh, and it's drained and you put it into the pasta and the pasta is ready. Turn off this. Mix the pasta well, and then can I have a plate, please? The big one, yes. I am not totally alone here. Truffle. Oh, truffle. That's truffle. So the dish is complete. Everything cooked with fire is hot. One fresh loaf of this. So the garlic is cooked. Fantastic. There it is. Now it took probably six, seven, eight minutes to cook a wonderful plate of pasta. And this, just with product that you can buy from Carluccio, we have the oil, chili oil, colatura, vongole, and the famous pasta. So simple. I want to taste it. Now let's taste if I've done it properly. Mm, mm. Mm. If you go to give the Arctic a better result, wouldn't have it in the rest of the actually. It's wonderful.